Hi guys, it's Mrs. Kushner, and today we are going to take a look at the four sentence types. For this video, you will need notes and a pencil. Pause the video if you need to, to get the notes shown here and click play when you're ready to go. In this video, you will learn about the four types of sentences, declarative, interrogative, imperative, and exclamatory. Now, Question one you might be wondering is, why write with different kinds of sentences? I didn't even know there were different types of sentences, so why do I need to write with them? Well, great question. It's because it adds sentence variety to your writing, which makes your writing more interesting. So at the end of the day, different sentence types add interest and sentence variety to your writing. Let's dive in with the first one, declarative sentences. The purpose of a declarative sentence is to make a statement or to tell information. And so the punctuation that goes at the end of a declarative sentence is what you're most used to. It is a period. So declarative sentences, the purpose is to make a statement and the punctuation is a period. An example would be the beach is a great place to go on family vacations. Interrogative statement sentences, on the other hand, their purpose or their function is to ask a question, to ask for information. So at the end of an interrogative sentence, you are going to put a question mark to reflect that. For example, what is your favorite beach activity? Next, third is imperative sentences. Imperative sentences make commands or they tell somebody to do something. This one is a little trickier though because it means you have some choices on the punctuation you end up using. And the punctuation you use is gonna change the tone or the sound of that command. So let's look at both of our examples to see what I mean. Example one, the author, the speaker, used an exclamation point, which made their command much more forceful when they said, don't swim out too far. On the other hand, that same speaker made another command or told their child to do something else when they said, please apply more sunscreen. But because they chose to use the word please, and because they chose to use a period instead of an exclamation point, they changed that command or that telling you to do something to be a more gentle telling you to do something. So punctuation could be a period or it could be an exclamation point, depending on what the speaker is trying to communicate. All right, next up is exclamatory sentences. The purpose of an exclamatory sentence is to show a really strong emotion, which is why we end them with an exclamation point to show that strong emotion. So for example, oh no, I got a sunburn. Lots of emotion there with that sunburn maybe because it, it feels uncomfortable now on their shoulders. In this video, you have learned about the four sentence types, declarative, interrogative, imperative, and exclamatory sentences. Great work today, and I will see you next time.